Okay, good evening ladies and gentlemen. Welcome aboard. We're going to do a flight from Auckland down to Wellington on the North Island of New Zealand. Going to be a quick flight. Going to try some new things. You might see some things pop up in your feed here in the uh, next day or two. But uh, trying to learn some stuff with doing some uh, streaming and everything else. So with that here we go we are going to uh, go ahead and go through our checklist we've already got a lot of things sort of the, the EFB going here so we're just gonna go into our checklist and we're gonna make sure everything's good landing gear is down speed brake is down flaps are up battery is on and covered standby power auto and covered DC voltmeter is to battery standby power or actually we'll get to that in a minute Battery, uh, master caution has been disengaged, electronic hydraulic pumps are off, fuel pumps are off, interior lights are set as needed, cabin utility, in-flight entertainment, passenger seat power is on, ground power is connected and on, and we have the AC voltmeter selected, so we can monitor that ground there, so we're good to go. Emergency lights are armed and covered, you can see that here, we can go ahead and get everybody uh, ready to go. Let the flight attendants, cabin crew know that we're good. And then we've already gone into our FMC. Fuel is already loaded up. Trim air is on. Research fans are auto. Left and right packs are coming to auto. There we go. Uh, IRS selectors are in nav. We're good. So now we can go down here and get our FMC set up. So... Position initialization reference airport is November Zulu Alpha Alpha. We're in Auckland. And we'll go over here, grab the GPS coordinates. Generally from the left, we'll do that today. And put it here, IRS position, we're set. You'll see all our screens did come alive. Got burned with that one a little while back. I had one of the switches in the wrong position and then uh, uh, was unable to get the airplane started had to hand fly it for a little bit so everything's looking good okay there on our route we are NZAA to November Zulu whiskey November that is Wellington and we will be shadow 69 Sierra Hotel Zulu 69er we'll put that in there and we can go to our route page, next page, or actually we're going to go to our arrivals and departures. We are going to depart on a runway 23 left. And we will be on the Ste2 Papa. And we're going out to Carl. Good there. And then we can go back to our arrivals. We did set up for our arrival. Um, I'll show you that here in just a moment. We are landing runway 16, ILS Zulu runway 16. And we will be coming in on the TPAP for Bravo. So TPAP for Bravo. And if we go back over here, let's go look at our, we're going to do the arrival uh, or the approach, ILS Zulu, runway 16. Oh, traffic is on 635, push it back, gate 30. Oh, got somebody there. So we are gonna going to be coming in. We are looking for whether we want D0990 or what's the other one. So let's see where we can find those. We're actually going to be coming in way over here. So I don't think we need one. We are coming in all the way up here and we will Whitby. So let's see if that's in there. Nope, we are good. So route. And then we can go ahead and look, Carl, Yankee 506, Yankee 506, and I'll go there into Tapa, and we should be good. So we can go ahead and activate that, execute our route, go on to performance initialization. That's where we get our numbers from, 119.8. Is our zero fuel weight? We're doing 14.9 for our fuel. 
plan. Reserves, 3.2. Cost index today is going to be 9. Racking them up today. And we're going to be flying at uh, 300. Top of climb wind will be 252 at 57. And now we can go ahead and execute that. Oh, while we are in here, let's go in here and airport briefing. We'll actually go to our departure. And our transition altitude is 13,000 feet. So let's change that. There we go. We're good to go there. So N1 limits we're not worried about. Takeoff, we're going to go with the flaps 5. Takeoff should give us about 4.6, I think. 4.3. So 4 and a third. There we go. And V1 speed 130. V rotate speed 132. V2 speed 144. That's going to go right here, 144. And we are set with that. So back to our checklist. We're all the way through there. We can get our APU started. So let's get our fuel pumps going and the APU started. Don't have any fuel in the center tank. So there you go. In the meantime, I am going to uh, see if I can. Let's see if this works. And we can go out and see if there's somebody pushed off of our stand 30. Oh, there he is. So got Air New Zealand right there. Let's get a screenshot of that. There we go. Back into the flight deck. Let's see if it jacked up my... No, we're good. All right. APU coming online. It is calming down there. And again, I want to thank everyone for showing up and joining me on tonight's flight. We're going to go T-A-R-A. We did make one change. We are running DLSS now. We are back to DLSS. I uh, thought I'd give it a try and uh, see if we could get it sorted out. But there you go. So um, APU is on. And it is selected. There you go. And move this over to APU Gen. So... Those are all A-OK. -okay. APU, APU, jet switches left and right on. APU, jet, engine bleeds are on. AC and master caution has been disengaged. So, squawk is set. Uh, yeah, we are doing one, two, three, four. Altimeter is set. And that, uh, we can, since we are here, one, zero, two, six. So, FMC departure, route legs, takeoff is good. Initial altitude. We're going to go straight up to uh, flight level 300. There we go. And we can come back in here since we are departing on runway 23 left. Get the runway heading. Runway 23 left is 231. set up there two three one and we will end up taxiing via bravo to alpha one hold point um, i don't see him on the move yet so we are good and back to our checklist all right so initial altitude is good we're heading takeoff elevator trim has been set is mock speed is good and yaw damper coming on cross feed bright dim and then bright off means our cross feed valve is working. It's just not active right now. So uh, coming back through here, we can come through down there. Good. Nothing there. We'll turn these up for you. It is a uh, morning here in Auckland, so we're good. 
Let them know we are about ready for departure. Window heat's coming on. Electronic hydraulic pumps coming on. And we can come through here. Flight level 300. And let's look. Our destination, uh, Wellington, is at uh, 41 feet, so we are okay there. Our minimums today, our minimum de departure is going to be 1,023 feet. Thousand twenty-three feet set there. So window heat's on. Anti-ice not needed. Okay, New Zealand uh, six three five texting holding point Alpha one two three left five Bravo Bravo one. There we go. We know everything now. So flight director's coming on. L nav V nav we're good. Reject to take off. Fuel is good, and we are set there. Auto brake doors. So now we can go ahead and get that door closed. And we can come over here, ground services. We will release that and get the jetway pulled away. Door is closed. Jetway coming off. And we're set. Okay, before we just start, parking brake is set. Chocks have been removed right now. We're going to go in there and do it. So if we go like this and we go push back, there you go. Chocks off. And we can go ahead and hit the start on that. Anti-collision light coming on. We've been cleared for pushback and start tail straight out. And since we are the first flight of the day, we will go ahead and uh, start with the start the right engine with the left igniters, left engine with the right igniters. Just make sure they both work. So there we go. 